Hello, friends and family. Welcome into your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird. All right, so this is going to be your love after midnight message. So, what inspired me to do this message is I keep seeing in my third eye someone land in a bed. Now, someone is likes to lay in the bed at night and scroll on their phone. This could be someone that likes to cross their legs and like one hand is like behind their head and they like to scroll on their phone. I don't know if that's the way they like to relax, if you know what I'm saying. Like someone is like laid back, their feet is crossed. They could have like one hand up and they like use their other hand to kind of like scroll in a launch position. Someone here also has blue lining these will be cotton sheets some of you also like cotton linen um i don't know if this is fabric softener or spray you use i don't know i just heard that but yeah that that okay yeah or something like that this is also someone i got like oh um, i saw like wood fur furniture this is like cherry up wood Now, I don't know what Value City got to do with this, but I heard Value City. So, let's see what is going on. This is what we're going to do. I want to see what messages is, is coming is going to be coming up off of this phone. Let's do that first. All right. Let's see what messages is coming up off this phone, child. All right. This is someone. Um, They could look you up on Facebook. Look up your social media, your Snap. I don't know. What they're um, scrolling through, but whatever they're scrolling through on their phone is definitely connected to you. This could be pictures too. Destiny is taking us down different paths. You deserve so much more. This is someone I heard they wish they could have given you more. Maybe this is why Def Destiny has taken you down um, uh, different paths. You are the only one who can make me feel this way. This is someone that's saying you are the only one that can make them feel this way. Maybe this is why they answer the scrolling on your phone at night, honey. I don't know. Let's see what this person wants to um, message you. I feel like someone wants to like text you. It's like they're on a the verge of just sending you a message here. This could be an email, a text, like I said, a snap, honey. They want to get in the DM. Mm. Uh, for some of you guys, this is the end, or this is something that ended. Um, I'm excited to, um, I'm excited by just the thought of you. For some of you guys, this is, um, something that ended already. This is also a relationship that could have ended through a text message or through you guys arguing and fighting through the phone or sending shots through the phone and it ended. And for some of you guys, this is something that you have ended already. I know it was my fault and I'm sorry. And that's what it is. That's what it is. Let's see what was their fault. And look, they're, they're crying. Mm, this person's energy, y'all. All right, let's see. Um, I'm gonna put this right here. I'm gonna see what the fault. What was what was their fault? What happened? What happened, y'all? Let's see. What happened? What is this? Yep. They had you and other options. They had you and other options. And for some of you guys, they had you in third place. Oh, this fell out. Yep. Six of Cups. This is someone here that's been getting karma. They realize they've been getting karma, karma, scorpionic energy. Here it is again. Seven of Cups. Um, For having you as an option. This is someone that thinks a lot about the past. I told you, Page of Swords. And this is someone that definitely watches you. They watch you because... You ended things. Maybe you ain't speaking to them. Things have already ended um, here. This is also something, like I said, this has already ended for a lot of you guys. It's a 
show me some cards. We're going to pull cards. Let's see. Damn. All right. Yep. There's a lot of burdens here. This person has caught judgment here. Yeah. Because you are, you've been, yep. The double cord in reverse. This is the second time I saw this today. This is someone here that, um, has been working on herself. This is someone that has been, I heard, inner demons. This is also someone here. Oh, they went through a transformation. They have went through an awakening here. Yep. And they want to talk. This is also someone that want to talk about why you guys are not talking, why things have ended, why things are not going the way they want. I heard used to in the past. They do watch you. They want to talk about what they have seen, what they have observed, also what options they have. Someone here has a full sleeve tattoo and someone here can have a tattoo on the back of their shoulder. Sad note. That was a damn it moment. This is your confirmation. Someone here got extended nipples. Now, that's your business. This is also someone here that I want to let you know the devil card in reverse in the seven of cups that they have let in go of other options or those other things, components, how whatever that means to you, that has stopped you guys from coming together. This is someone that caught judgment already. They realize that this has caused burned burdens, and this is why you um has in this ended. Someone here is, realizes the reason why you are cut them off or not talking to them because they had you, they treated you like a karmic. They had you in a third party. They lied about it. Um, they had you in their feelings. They never gave you an apology. They, um, they, they did. They chose over you. Yep, they did. They might have not have recognized that you guys were deeper than y'all were supposed to. They gained feelings more than they probably should have here because there was a spiritual connection and this ended here and now they want to come in um fight defend themselves defend their honor i just heard maybe give some truth some honesty be authentic that's what the queen of swords do she don't give a she don't give a damn whether you're on her for a man or a woman okay um here i just want to see uh why is the double card in reverse Wait, I don't like the way that I'm tell all y'all. Let me see. What's the double card in reverse? Why is the double card in reverse? Yep, justice. This person has gotten justice because they've been healing. And um they have been and and someone here, the universe has granted granted their wishes here because they um have been healing and they've been able to let go of some burdens of some toxic ways this is someone still that might have some things they're working on but the big things i feel like the um you know the dark deepest things they worked on first and they it, they have been going through some um transformation but the thing is what's bothersome them is that they're not able to even share that with you talk to you you guys aren't talking here the king and the queen of swords it ended y'all ain't talking and that's it, it this is bothering this person they feel like a fool mm -hmm. that's exactly what's going on with this um, let me see what else. I, what let's see what other burdens is here. Some of you guys could have a teenage, a, a single mom. You could be a teenager. Someone here also realizes that you were honest in the things that you said. They think about that a lot. What else is this? Show me. What is this? Someone here could work in construction. Someone here is um could do like back backyard work, tree work, landscaping, some shit like that. Okay, page of cups here and the king of pentacles. Someone here never gave you a um an emotional kind of fulfillment. This could come with an apology, an offer of an apology. Yep. And that's what they want to do. They want to talk. They want to, whatever this is and however they want to do this, they want this to get them out of the five of pentacles and get you guys into talking again. See in this deck, the knight of pentacles, it has a worker belt on with his pentacle, not a guard, not a um, armor. This is someone that is letting their armor down and putting on the work belt because they want to work on this. Yep. Three of pentacles. 
Period. Um, I want to look at, yep. Yeah, yeah, here they come, honey. I want to look at you. See, that's what they call judgment on. On you. Okay. And here's that text message. Page of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. All right. Nine of Wands in the Four of Pentacles. Yeah. And for some of you guys, they want to defend this, okay? They do, and they're going to try to sneak back in your energy whether you want them or not, whether you want them to or not, so get ready. What are they looking at? Show me this. What are they looking at? Mm. Now, for some of you guys, they're trying to see if you're fucking with somebody else. The lover's card is here. God damn it. And for some of you guys, they do. Um, here, yeah. And I knew it. Four or ones and the Knight of Swords in there are sneaking past your house. Yep, the Ten of Pentacles. They could be, I heard, Establishment and Eight of Cups. And for some of you guys, if they are not driving and they live close, then they asses is walking by. That came out in another reading today. So a little bit of that energy is this here. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. They also have been um, looking to see what's going on with you to make sure you ain't fucking with somebody else. So they looking around the picture. Shit, they ain't just looking at your picture. They looking around the picture, underneath the picture, behind the picture. Who the fuck is this? Who the hell? Oh, okay, that's the plan. I thought that was somebody. Okay, she had me fucked. Oh, he had me fucked up. Like, they doing that kind of shit, okay? Yeah, eight of wands, okay? Because they want to talk to you. The sun card, because in reverse, because they're in their feelings. And the divine has been getting on them about how they um, came against you, how they treated you, and they want to talk about it. All right. Ding, ding, that is your confirmation. Let's um see this person's feelings and emotions right now. We know what they want to say. Now, they're feeling of trapped. Why? Because they're stubborn. This is someone that might need to get out their own way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Oh, God, I didn't bend my card up. Yeah, justice. This is someone, they want justice. That um, They want this contract back. Yeah. Um. Here profession they're willing to work on it someone here wants to cook for you you could be a cook and this is someone here that could want to take you out to a fancy restaurant yeah yeah laws why loss is here and to stop you someone here also could want to tell you and stop and stop you you know let you know that they also had lost a pet also, a dog is a friend. They want to let you know that not only did they lose someone they love, they feel like they lost a friend in you. All right. Let's um, see what else this person want to say. Because I feel like there's like a little bit more. We'll pull a couple more messages. Then we'll get some oil quotes for you guys. Let's uh, um, give me some more messages. What is going on? Mm. here it is i'm in love with you shit i don't even know if i should continue the damn reading you are the only one who gets me without me saying anything and sometimes that's just what you need balance someone here you balance this person it's peace thank you for teaching me how to appreciate the small things in life and that's the thing see Peace is like a small thing that has great value. We go out here and got to fight the world. When I come home, I need somebody. Peace. Be my peace. Some Jacquee shit. Be my peace. All right, what's this? I'm thinking of you in this very moment, in this very moment. I miss you. Aw. You bring the best out of me. Sometimes when I get busy, I pause to think of you, and it's a breath of fresh air. Exactly. In the world, you know, going to work every day. You want to come home to that person that brings that balance, that store, that energy, you know, that you need. You know, you that stores that balance of energy is what I meant to say, guys. All right. All right, let's see. Ooh. Yep, this shit's with flame. That's why. Mm. Uh, 11 11 is an important number for twin flames it symbolizes the harmony and balance of soul counterparts and that's what this person has in such a big guilt trip about because they know you guys are twins and they want to rekindle this this is someone here that feels like this is um the power of this twin flame connection can be rekindled all right and they want to temptation and bond this person is very tempted to do this they want this with you i feel like both of you guys do yep commitment 
Now, some of you guys, someone here could be shopping for a ring. This could lead to a commitment. Now, I'm not saying marriage. We're going to pull some a love oracle card right now. This could just be a, you know, commitment. All right. Promise rings, you know, <laughs> is not necessarily, you know, always marriage. It could just be, you know, this person promising to do what they need to do. Okay. Let's see. What's going on here? Love oracle messages for the collective. What do you have? Okay, mm -hmm. I'm going to get them. This person is really not into energy. This could be someone that's not really into, like, reading. But you know, we're going to get them. Oh, hold on. Mm. Show me. Mm. I just saw soul, soulmate, finance, and career. Someone here could be um, looking at you as this is soulmate, twin flame, energy. Twin flame came out, soulmate showed itself. All right, someone here could be working on their money and shit. All right, so be pay pay attention to that here, but they want you um, free yourself. Oh shit! Damn it, that's absolutely insane. Damn it! See, you freed yourself from the situation. This ended. This is gonna lead to a wedding. I said, let me grab the love oracle message before I said it. No wonder. Why? Because it was going to be confirmed. For some of you guys, this commitment is going to turn into a wedding. This is just your confirmation, baby. Um, Separation in reverse. I turned that around. Yeah. See, the thing is, free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. And when you did that, you took your power back. Oh, and the power card came out. Some of you guys might need to rewind the video because I don't feel like going through the cards. But, um, and messing it up, you know, I'd be liking them look pretty for you guys. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's just what it is. Let's just pick up these two. Yep, flirt and attraction. This is going to start off as a flirt and attraction and grow into one thing to another. It's not flame shit. Damn it. You're stressing me out. But you are stressing this person out. I'm going to get you guys a regular oracle. We'll get your signs and planets. Mm -hmm. Let's just get a regular oracle for you. What's the regular oracle message here for the collective? Thank you. Yeah, you can't go back to yesterday. This is someone that realizes that, and that's why they just want to move forward. That's what it, yep, never jam today. They just want to move forward. They want, they could just want to touch lightly on some things. I heard hit the surface that needs to be, and then let the rest of the shit go. Yep, nurture communication, like I just said, and just let the rest of the shit go. So you guys could just, you know, move on. Let's get your signs and planets. What's the signs and planets? All right, we got Capricorn and the moon. Someone here is definitely got the karma here. This person um knows that for going against their, their twin flame, their counterpart. Okay, we got Geminian and Arian also that wants to communicate here. This is sounds like planets. Geminian, third house is there, honey. Libra Contracts is here. You can also have Libra in your third house. Sagittarian also showed itself. Okay. All right, guys. I love you all. Stay dope. So this is what's going on. Whether you're on here for a man or a woman, you know, we're going to have a little Mr. Rogers neighborhood moment. This person is scrolling on their phone at night, late at night in their bed. They're lounge. They're comfortable. Um, someone here is in their basketball shorts. Someone here has their robe. Someone here likes wine before bed. They do all this shit as they get relaxed. You are part of their relaxed routine. They lay back, pick their feet up, kick off the shoes, and relax the feet. Party on down to the ass. Can't beat this shit. Y'all, I'm, I'm tired. Uh, I've been at the hospital all day. I'm tired, guys. <laughs> so, excuse me. I'm a little bit off. Uh, my little, the hummingbird ain't on all the way. But, you know, I got you. All right. But this person, when they kick off their shoes and relax their feet, you're part of that ritual. You help this person at night. They have to look at you before they go to bed. And we don't know what else they could be doing, child. That's between y'all because I heard something. I'm going to let that go. All right. I love you all. Just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the... Yeah, okay. So that's what this person does. And that's what this person wants you to do. This is someone that wants to kick off their shoes and relax their feet when they get close to you. And they want the same energy with you with them. Yeah. 
All right, guys, you know I am tired. I got my man voice on. I love you. <laughs> my little raspy voice on when I get tired, y'all. I be all. I love you. Stay dope, guys. Don't forget to hit that bell. Hit all. That's your frequency, guys. Your energetic frequency tuned into this reading, this channel, and other readings that you're getting. So when you are coming in and getting your messages, rather part of the message resonates with you or your full message does. Keep in mind, these are general messages. Okay, guys. Your energy is here, and they're coming out for you. So when you're coming in, you're getting them. I love you. Next time, Ashe Amon.